Hey there, Marksman. What is up with the Swift Shot Outdoors? My name is Luke, and I'm very glad you're here. Today's gonna be more of a vlog style video. I'm gonna take you through a few different things today, and we're just gonna kind of see where the day takes us. There he is right there. I know it's uh, kind of blurry, it's going through a window, but there he is right there, folks. Squirrel in the backyard, and we're gonna go get him. All right, y'all, I'm literally sitting here right and I'm just gonna sit here and wait until that squirrel comes out. I have no idea how long this is gonna take, but I was wondering if you guys could help me achieve a goal. All right, I'm trying to get my likes to go up. I was wondering if we could reach the goal of 35 likes on this video. It is my birthday after all, so uh, that'd be a great birthday present to me from y'all. So thank you for doing that. All right, now I'm gonna focus and we're gonna get this squirrel. Okay, so long story short, that didn't work out. I sat there for a decent amount of time and uh, never heard him again and he never came back out. So, I'm just going across the road from my house into uh, the corner back there and see if we can get any squirrels back there. Sorry, I know it's really windy. We got some squirrel tracks here already. Not even in the woods yet. We got some signs. We'll just keep looking. sitting down and um, I'm waiting for the squirrels. I know it may look cold outside, but I'm perfectly warm. I got two battery powered hand warmers. They last like two to three hours each. They got three settings, low, medium, and high. So my hands will be perfectly fine. And you already know I got my battery powered heated vest on by Aurora. I'm not sponsored by either of these products, but I'm gonna put the link to them on Amazon in the description so you can stay warm while you're hunting too. Alright, so I've been sitting here a little while and I just haven't really seen anything. Even um, the tracks here aren't super recent, so I think I might go back to the edge of the field where I was seeing those tracks earlier and then maybe I'll run into something on my way out. If you like these custom steel targets, I actually made them in a previous video. I'm going to tag it up above in the corner. But yeah, they're very nice AR500 steel. Go into the ground easy and stay put. And they're just great quality. Alright, let's get to shooting. This is my Ruger BC Carbine 9mm. We're gonna send some rounds through. Here is my Browning Buckmark 22 long rifle.
The other nice thing about these targets is if you break them accidentally shooting off one of the clamps, it's an easy fix. You just undo the bolt on the back, throw another one on, and you're good to go. So unfortunately, I don't have my socket wrench, so I just have to use an adjustable one. So it might take a little longer, but I'll just time lapse it so you guys don't have to sit here and waste your time. So now I just get a new piece of tin with two holes drilled out in it. I'm just going to put it onto the bolt, flip it over the top, press it down, and then I just put the nut back on. And there, now it's good as new. No longer a broken target, and it's ready to take some more shots. Now I got to do the other one. And now this one is fully operational too. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Remember, we're trying to reach 35 likes on this video. So thank you for helping me achieve that goal. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to become a marksman for weekly content. Don't forget this Sunday, the 24th, I'll be live streaming on Twitch at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Here's my Twitch username. Thank you for joining me this Sunday. And also don't forget to follow me on Instagram at SwiftShot underscore outdoors for behind the scenes content and any other kind of content you wouldn't see on here. But other than that, I have nothing else for you. And remember, I love each and every single one of you. And don't forget to stay on target. Good, bye.